Hello everyone, this is Mask Voyant and today is a special video because I will be remaking the science repertory from my school into a brewing or potion room if it was in a medieval fantasy like era. For now, I have showed the clip of the science lab that I have taken and used it as my reference. Now let's start the build. From the start, I measured the area of the classroom, which I assume to be is a 16 by 16 blocks in the Minecraft world, since it's hard to measure it in a way. And then I traced it, or marked it rather, using stone bricks, since that will be the materials I'll be using as a wall and some parts of the floor. Once I finished marking the area, I decided to clear off all the dirt in the middle, so I'll just cut to the chase instead. See you soon! Now that's done, I start filling out the floor here by 4 or 5, then leave the ends with 3 and 2 blocks of stone brick. While on the other side, I'll be using dark oak slabs to cover it up. The stone brick area is for the teacher, or I guess wizards and witches, to demonstrate and teach the students, while the wooden area are obviously for the students. Now that's done, I'm just going to start building the walls, but first I'll build my door on this corner, which is 3 blocks separated. And here is the door frame, which is 3 blocks high, but I use a stone brick stairs and place it upside down to look like some sort of arch or doorway to the classroom. I build it one more up, so the wall should be at least a, to a total of 4 blocks high. I'll start building the walls, like I said, 4 blocks high, and I'll see you soon. Bye! And the last bit of wall here. Now we will make a pillar or arch as well in the middle of the classroom so it will not only act as a design but seem like it's supporting the roof above it. I made the pillars two blocks wide and I counted to make sure it was even out on both sides as well. Down on here, I just build it across and soon build another pillar on that side so to look natural and even. So that's done. I'm just going to start designing the room. And you can either follow or listen to the things I have to say about my school. The name of my school is Good Tree International School, and at first, I thought I would have a hard time studying and adjusting to it since. I didn't learn the language of my country yet. I was relieved to learn that it was an English-speaking zone, so it was easy for me to at least learn and adjust. Second, I learned a new hobby each Wednesday from the school as well and enhanced it, which also gave me a better understanding of how I work physically. And there are so many courses to choose from, from sports to arts and languages. And lastly, the school helped me to understand and improve myself. It also connected me with God. It did help me to become more confident in what I do and taught me some morals that I could have never learned. And that's all of what I have for my school. For now, I'm just going to let you all enjoy the builds. So I'll see you soon. Bye!
And that's all. See you next time. Bye-bye.